Spoons are probably the oldest northern pike lure in history. They date back a couple hundred years. They've been catching northern pike from Europe, all of Canada, the United States. But what makes a spoon so attractive? There's a lot of different things. They've got a flash to them. They've got a wobble to them. They come in different colors. Spoons have it all. Now spoons come in all sizes, shapes, and models. Some are oblong, some are elongated, some are hammered, and some are just plain. They come in all different ounces, from 1 8 ounce up to 5 ounces. Something to keep in mind when you're fishing a lake, sort of like match the hatch. If you're on stained water, copper works great. Gold colored works great. Five of diamonds works fantastic. So does a uh, red and white daredevil. Okay, spoons work all season long. And you know what? The pike will tell you what kind of presentation they like. Oh, we're going over here, huh, bud? It's on that spoon, Steve. Come over here. Oh, he's pulling me. He's pulling me. Where'd you go? Using a spoon there. It was only about my third or fourth cast of the day. Just kind of at about a medium pace, grinded it in there. I just had a 40 incher, just chase it in. I didn't see it. Uh, Grant caught it there right at the end. I had already pulled my lure out, so I was hoping I could get this guy. He hit right at both sides there, too. So put up a good fight. Let's get him out here and take a look. All right. He devoured that thing. It's a nice fish. Oh, there we go. Nice pike. Good fish there. Real nice pike. Again, I was using a spoon, gold, uh, with the red eyes here. Going a little weedless, but that's what I was using. We had one, like I said, this was like my fourth or fifth cast of the day here. Had about 40 inch of chase, chase the first one. Then I got this bad guy. Good fish. Let's go ahead and put him back. What? My GoPro's gone. Uh, fish on! Fish on! Fish on! Whoa! I got a silver pike, it's rare! Yeah, baby! What we have here is another spoon fish. I cast it out. I was going up and down pumping it like we talked about. And she hit out there quite a ways. It's a beautiful fish. Now, if I'm right, this is a silver pike. They're rare, very rare. That is a beautiful, beautiful pike. You can see the purple here, and a little bit of purple and red throughout the body tint. It changes color when it's wet. It's a beautiful fish. It's a silver pike. 
There, she's upright. There she goes. There she goes. Come under the boat. Why don't you go underneath there? Another spoon catch there. I was just thinking about uh, switching into a different color. We we're getting a little greedy here. We we're fishing for about 20 minutes, nothing popped, so we thought maybe we'll switch it up, but this is one of my last casts. We got it, so let's take a look at this. All right. Another good sized pike. Uh, working the spoon there again. Uh, there's a lot of different ways you can work spoons. Uh, this one, I was just reeling it in about at a medium pace there, going through the weeds. Good fish. Good fish to catch here. There she goes. Oh, yeah, I saw your pole had loaded up. Yeah. And I about pumped there, and I'm like, nope. There you go, come on! Stay on it, stay on it. Alright, the net. Oh, she's, he's yep. taking me. Yep, the net's on you. Oh. Stay on him. Come on. Oh, this is a big one. Woo! Get back here. Oh. He tied on when I just bombed it out there. Oh, come on. Get in here. He's tied up in the weeds good. I can see him here shortly. Oh, there he is. I see him. I see him. Around you, around you, around you. Oh, I got him in the gill. All that weed caught up in there. Man, that thing felt like he was huge. Oh. And I didn't even get a good hook on him. Yep, he's already got the lure loose. Boated him just at the right time. Let's get this out of here and take a look. All right, look at this monster. Woo! Oh, heavy fish. <laughs> This, this was definitely a good fight. What made it really tough too, got tangled up in all that weeds there, all this cabbage. I was throwing spoons out there. I was just yelling, I just missed a hit. And I tossed it right back in the same spot. I knew the one I missed was a monster. I wouldn't be surprised if this was the one I missed. But let's go ahead, let's get this baby back in. Beautiful, beautiful pike. There you go. She's still got a lot of fight. Fish. Not a big one, though. No, not a big one. I could be wrong. No, it's a good one. It's a good one. Oh, 
Get me the net though. Another spoon. Just barely got that guy. Just barely had that hooked right in the corner of the mouth there. Another nice fish. Got this one. Kind of on the outskirts of the weed bed. Using the spoon. Just uh, slowly bringing it back, just enough to get a little bit of that wobble going on those spoons that we like. Give it a good hard hit. Now let's see. Come on, I just want to see ya. Oh jeez! That's way bigger than I thought! <laughs> Looked a little bit smaller in the net there. But this is a huge fish. Whew, bet Sportsman's Lodge, catching monsters like this on the weed bed. Oh, beautiful fish. Again, caught it on a spoon, slowly bringing it out there on the edge of a weed bed. Popped it, and it was done. Let's put this one back. Oh, there we go. Come on, I'm gonna take off there. There we go. We'll see you, Mama. <laughs> 